right. Friday morning. Solo job today. Because it's not really, doesn't really justify paying two wages on this. Keep the cost down for the customer a bit. Yeah, this is coming down. Most of the drive isn't that what isn't very wide, and the road's not very wide, so she wants a bit more room for swinging the car in and out. So, so that's coming down. Take it down below ground, and we've got the tarmac to patch the hole. Same here. Drop it all the way down, <coughs> and half patch the hole and half soil. Don't know what exactly how we're doing that yet till we get to it, and then we're going to chop the wall down out make it good so it just ends no pillars so we're gaining three foot on the width of the drive which is way better see the drive edging comes to there anyway this one here I might have to just move over that move the edging over put it back in there straight and then oh, we'll settle it we'll do we'll sort it but we've got the big guns today Bit of the bully, and we're just going to um, pile of stuff here because the, the house is eventually getting windows, so there'll be a skip coming, but not yet. So there's no point getting two skips, yeah. So that's that's what we're up to today, or I'm up to today. Alex is still in bed, yep. So let's get cracking.
Here we go, Pop Master's one, so it's after half ten now. Pull the one down. Tell you what, <laughs> they put up a fight, these two. Well, I don't know what the other one's going to be like, but I've, I've time lapsed the bottom of this, but I've just found the camera dead, so probably a good chance we missed it, so I'll film the bottom of the next one. Yeah, so we'll be down the course below the drive for the tarmac, which is there in the sun. Left out in the sun, so it's getting. Nice and workable. Let's pick this stuff up. Bitumen cold joint sealer and tack coat. So never used that before but it's gonna it should make a nice join to the old from the new. <clears throat> yes yeah, so that one's down. I'm gonna have a quick drink now. Just the customs made me and let's start on this one. It's the uh, the concrete core that's doing us just show you what so that pillar equates to that this pillar top and there's the concrete core so I said it's a good job she's doing it that with the car because the car will definitely would have come off worst so it's looking wider already so we've gained 18 inches we're going to gain another 18 inches so it's going to be nice and wide Here's a quick one for you. This is the uh, the wigging job we've just done, the house on the hill we called it. So we've got uh, flights climbed. There's the three days we were there. So you've got, we did 23 floors, 22 floors Wednesday, Thursday, 15 floors. So what's that? 23, 45, 60 floors. They couldn't have walked up 60 floors for those three days and Alex did more because he's doing a lot more later than me we go back to a walking distance we did that wasn't that that was the so it's we did 3.3 3.4 .3, 3 and 2.6 so we did some walking up and down there and 28 degree heat it was a killer but it did look good at the end so yeah you do, you do all the work and you do all that walking as well. It's deceiving.
Well, that's lunch done. That's both pillars down, tidied up. Getting ready to tarmac this one now. Here's the tarmac. Here's the spray. Bitumen cold joint sealing tap coat. So I'm going to spray it on there so it sticks. And then spray around the edges to seal it. And see how we get on.
Number one done. Not bad if you ever do say so myself. Solid. Three inch thick solid. Carmack. Once I've pieced that up, the drivers are done so much better. Look at that. No need for the drop to curb to be changed either because the curb's that low. Not a problem. Yeah, so one down, one to go, and then one, two, three bricks to patch on either side. One, two, three. Two heads and a brick and edge on each side. Let's get the next side. There we go, both sides patched up and whackered solid. There's 150 kilos of tarmac going in there. Six twenty-five kilo bags. No. How much wider that drive is now? Now it's better. And no pillars to catch the car on. Yeah, so I'm going to just knock a bit of a hand, hand mix a bit of mortar and patch the two walls up. There's um, one, two, three brick on each pillar. So we'll get, get that done. Half past two now.
Right, quick outro because the battery's about to die. There you go. Well, tarmac, edging back in, brickwork patched. So now you can see just how much wider the drive is. Customs already used it, made up with it. Nice little day's work that, on another hot day. Yeah, made up with that. So, don't forget, if you like, if you like it, press the like button. Subscribe and click that bell for notifications. So, thanks so very much and we'll see you in the next one.